What's up guys? We're back shooting another video today. Today we're going to show you how to lift a minivan with the little Hercules 2.0. Let's go. Pretty easy. Uh, the Ford's got a dotted line that go in the middle that tell you the center of the back of the truck, which we're looking for the center on the uh, minivan as well. So the first step what we're going to do is we're going to go out with the unit, of course. And then you could start backing up. Um, it's not really a big deal. You don't have to wait. And then we're going to bump close, get them arms open. And again, we're going to line, if this, if your truck don't have this dotted line on it, which Chevy and Dodges do not, you can see the uh, main pin there, hex pin. We're going to line that up in the middle of the Chrysler emblem. And we're going to go down. We're just going to hover right over the concrete. And then again, see how we got the uh, center of the hex pin almost damn near right in the middle of that Chrysler. That means we're going to be centered going in. And then we're going to feel a little bump against the tire. We're going to hit close. We're going to close around the tire and then up. And that's it. First we're gonna do is take our ratchet, make sure it's not tangled up. We're gonna hook it in right there. Boom. Now you take your strap, kinda on a diagonal here. We're gonna come down here and we're gonna hook in to the front side of our uh, crossbar in the D-ring location. Then, kinda straighten that out, give this a nice pull, and then you can really if your strap's a little long, you can tuck it up back in there, hold it, proper way how to strap the tire down on a minivan. All right, another thing I wanted to talk about with the new straps, uh, yes, they are going to stretch, so this little bulge in the tire is not an issue. Um, the, like I said, the new straps will stretch some, and that will be okay. So now we're going to move over to the safety chains so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to get the chains out and long enough so they can reach to our chaining point which is going to be this a-arm so if you crawl under here zach or get up there we're going to go right to this a-arm we're going to loop around get a little bit more slack here boom and then we pull that tight this is the perfect amount of slack that you want in your chains you want them just about to touch the ground it's okay if they drag um, you'd rather have them loose like this rather than so tight when you turn it starts binding up and breaking stuff and if you look here we got it attached to the control arm make sure you don't tie it up to a tie rod or something that's not going to hold uh, the safety chains up could bend it or anything like that. Super easy to take the straps off. Just any basic normal ratchet. Pow. Pull a little bit of slack. Unhook there. Reach around here. Pow. Roll them up. Put them away. And the same goes for the chains. The only thing is you got to climb under here. Pull some slack in your chain. All right guys, so now let's say we wanted to set this minivan back down real simple. All we're gonna do is hit down with the controller. And now this is a more of a feel thing. So I can feel the rear of the truck go up and you can kind of see it in the video a little bit. Well, once you know that rear goes up and you can feel it come off the ground some, now we're gonna hit open. And then now that we hit open, the arms have closed back. 
and then we're gonna go forward and then just start bumping it up and then we can go in 